there's a, few, there's a few lessons in that channeling for you as an audience. What, what are they? Yes. 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 Now understand that the majority of the time, many of you are still in heavy addictions. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. When it comes to processing, in particular, any anger, mm -hmm. still in heavy addictions, and the addiction is just wanting to feel angry rather than feel the fear. Mm -hmm. Right, so, so you want to be want to be angry rather than feeling afraid. And while you want to be angry rather than feeling afraid, these women spirits are just they have a field day. And you, and you do it. Many of you are doing this in the name of the divine love path, dealing with your emotions, which is a complete absurdity to actually state that to you. See, is love doesn't get into a rage all the time and get into the same rage the next time and the same rage the next time and the same rage the next time. Love doesn't do that. Mm -hmm. right? So this is something to look at. So so what's the reason why this this lady was quite um, feels quite um, you know condescending towards you as a group is because in the name of emotion you're not dealing with emotions mm -hmm. and you're giving these spirits an opportunity to actually get into their rages. Through you. I feel like, too, I know I've done it myself, um, as I've been processing emotions, I've become more sensitive to the people around me who don't know anything about their emotions. And the, that condescension goes out towards them, you immediately place a judgment on them, or you're just angry. Yeah. And ignoring my own law of attraction in the process. Exactly, and, and ignoring the fact that you're just judging somebody. Yeah, and, and you don't even have to verbalise it. It's a feeling that's in me where I go, oh, you know, the person behind that counter is cranky and had a bad day. And, but yeah. it's just all that, all, that, all that thought process that goes yeah. with it about who they are and making assumptions. Which Remember, this path is about love. Yeah. It's not about your emotions. Mm. You see how many of you are still making it about your emotions and not about love? Mm. It's, in fact, in fact, other people looking at that could think that that's pretty self-absorbed. Mm. Well, and it is. It is. Mm -hmm. Because you're not making it about love, you're making it about, I'm allowed to have my emotions. Mm -hmm. but the reality is that the emotions of rage, while they may be within you, and some of you do have some childhood rage to experience, Unfortunately, the majority of times you're feeling rage, you're not feeling childhood rage. Mm. You're feeling adult rage. Mm. And a lot of times you're not even feeling your own rage. Mm. That's the irony. You're feeling the rage of spirits with you, projecting their rage through you because they can. Mm. Because you give them an open slather. You just darken your condition. You just darken <coughs> your own condition because you're now damaging somebody else through your rage. But on top of that, they're darkening, the spirit's darkening their condition, so you're actually helping a spirit darken its own condition yeah. as well. And, and then in the end, no causal emotion was addressed. Mm. So in other words, the whole point of you justifying your do your doing of it is all lost. Do you, do you understand? Mm -hmm. See, this is, this is where we've got to be very careful, right? We're, we're not doing this for any other reason than to become more loving. If we're not becoming more loving and we're becoming more obnoxious, mm. <laughs> then we've got a problem. Mm. Right? Like you're better off you're better off not expressing all of that rage mm. and sitting on it all. Mm. That'd be more loving mm. than actually doing what many are doing. Right? Of course the best choice of it is to feel what's going on inside of you, not project it at other people. And get into the deeper, gri the deeper terror. In fact, did you, you see how numb that lady was to her own terror? Mm. Just totally numb. She was there laughing at you, mm. numb to her own terror. Yeah. And that's that's a fairly common thing to do.